Hey guys, Matt from Crank Engineering. And if you've ever wondered how to get a lower steering stem bearing off, just like this one, keep watching and I'll show you how. The bearing really has got no intention of coming off without being destroyed. I could probably heat it up with a torch and see if I can expand it enough to get it off. But that inner race or is pressed onto the steering stem. So it's an interference fit. And I've spoken about limits and fits in another video. So I'm gonna put a link somewhere to that so you can get a bit of background. But I think we have to cut it off. And that's pretty normal with bearings on shafts. So I'm going to show you how I do it with the tools that I have and I'll be using a Dremel and I've spoken about those in other videos, link somewhere. And I'll need a Dremel and a cold chisel to split the inner race. So the objective is to cut this guy off without damaging the steering stem. So we're going to use a Dremel to cut through the cage and let the ball or the rollers come, come out. And then we're going to carefully cut through the inner race that's pressed onto this shaft, onto the steering stem. And we're going to cut as much as we can uh, without damaging the stem. And then we're going to use the cold chisel, the wedge at the end of the cold chisel to split it open. So you could use an angle grinder, but not as much finesse with an angle grinder. And obviously with a large disc, you're just running a risk of damaging the stem. We were trying to avoid that. So I'll use a Dremel. So let's get back to the bench and see how I do it.